Is it easier to mix concrete in a trash can? Can it even be done? Let's find out. With the latest craze of this dry pour thing that's going on and all this talk about how much easier it is than mixing concrete the traditional way, I can't help but think to myself, is there an even easier way to mix and pour concrete? And then I remembered, many years ago, uh, in one of my magazines, there was this small article on mixing concrete in a trash can. It was supposed to be a much easier way of mixing concrete as opposed to traditionally mixing it in a wheelbarrow. The, the premise is that you put the dry concrete in the trash can, pour a bunch of water on it, and then start rolling it around on the ground pretty much like a, your own DIY cement mixer. But I immediately discounted the article thinking that it was just a bunch of BS and it would never work. But I have a lot of viewers that are either disabled or are the, of the age of that they simply just can't mix concrete the traditional way anymore, but they have some concrete that they, they need to have done and they can't afford a professional. So I thought to myself, let's try it out. Well, I guess in order for this to be an easier option, we gotta figure out an easier way to get this bag into this trash can other than lifting it up and putting it over. <laughs> and I didn't think about that until just now. Probably help if we open the bag. So far so good. Pretty easy so far. Now I'd imagine that we're, we're gonna water it down, roll it around, Maybe water it some more, roll it around, and keep doing that until we feel like we've got a nice, consistent mixture. That is actually not turning out too bad. I just gotta keep putting some more water in it, spin it, put some more water in I think this is gonna be really good. I think that's it. And the consistency is really good. It's a nice consistent mix. Now I can just simply roll it over to where I want to pour it. Well, I don't know about easier, but it's definitely sloppier. I think this comes in handy to get into the corners. On this second batch, I definitely learned the hard way that don't put too much water in all at once. Do a little bit at a time. I found that it's not mixing as well and I have to get in there with a hand shovel and try to hand mix it anyway just to get all the, the dry parts. 
which completely defeats the purpose at that point. Well, not the most eloquent way to mix cement, but I did successfully mix cement consistently with a good slump. Was it easier than mixing it up in, say, a wheelbarrow? It was a huge pain in the ass. It, it was easy at first, but then uh, I got pretty tired after rolling this back and forth, trying to get a consistent mix and trying to get into the corners and I don't know. I, I suppose it has its place, but uh, not in my backyard. So unfortunately, I give this idea a big thumbs down. I wonder what these forms are for.